Hi everyone, um, today I'm going to be doing a video on my thoughts of the Lily Cole makeup range at um, the body sh shop. Um, I've got one, two, three, four, six things um, that I want to talk about. Um, the first thing I brought was this um, Shimmer Cube palette. This just says Shimmer Cube palette 24, um, which looks like that. There's four colours in there. Um, it comes in this packaging. Um, I'll show you the colours first because I've already got them on my hands. Um, so here are the colours. Hope you can see that. Okay, they are gorgeous, gorgeous, shimmery, gorgeous colours. Um, there they are on my fingers. Um, I love this colour here and this one. Um, really, really, really gorgeous beautiful colours. Um, I've got this on my eyes today. Hopefully you can um, see that, how shimmery and gorgeous they are. Um, I've been using this palette um, last couple of days. i am absolutely been loving it. Um, so those were the eyeshadows. Um, just rub this off my hand so I can go into more detail um, with the eyeshadows. They come, like I was saying, this packaging, um, you undo them. I've already got all the lids off mine, but they come, if I can get one out, they come in their own little um, tub. So it's got a lid on, so I think they are great um, for travelling, um, really really good and you can mix and match um, the colours you want to keep in here or if you want any colours taken out, do you know they're going to be safe because they've got the lid on. Um, so I absolutely adore this, this was £16 which I don't think is too bad because you get quite a lot of product in each eyeshadow. So I'm really really loving that and I love the colours. Um, gorgeous beautiful colours so I'm loving that and they stay on for a long time also which is always good and then I got two um, lip glosses well they are called high shine lip treatment I have got one in nude and one in go play um, here are the colours here so we have Go Play, which is here, and Naked, if you can see it there. They are quite shimmery. They are really, really, really pretty gorgeous colours, but um, the only problem is, is they are way, way too sticky. Um, I always thought the e.l.f. Um, lip um, glosses were sticky, um, so... I've stopped buying the e.l.f. ones because they are way too sticky for me. Um, if you do not like the e.l.f. Um, lip glosses and you think they're too sticky, um, I'm afraid you won't like these because, in my opinion, these are more sticky than the e.l.f. ones. Um, these were £4 each, which I think it's okay. But they're just way, way too sticky, so that's a thumbs down for me on them. Um, rub that off my hand and um, the next two things I got was um, the lip and cheek domes um, which look like this the packaging is absolutely gorgeous I've cracked my one here um, I absolutely adore adore the packaging it's like bees eyes I don't know why I just did that um, but yeah I got crazy for coral and Pinch Me Pink, I think these were the only two, there might have been a third, I am not sure so don't quote me on that. Um, these, if I do a swatch, you can also use these on your lips. Um, I did try these on my lips but my lips being dry it didn't work at all. Um, so here's a swatch. There is the Pinch Me Pink, if I'm correct, <laughs> yeah, Pinch Me Pink, and that is crazy for coral, 
these colours are absolutely gorgeous. I've got the Pinch Me Pink on today, which I doubt um, you will be able to see. Um, I am on the fence with these. I absolutely adore, and I mean adore the colours. Um, the only problem is I'm blending them. I've tried so many ways. I've tried, like I put them straight on, then I try blending them with a brush, but that just takes it all off. Um, so what I do now is I apply it and then use my fingers and it works. But the only problem then is um, they've got no staying power at all. Um, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to try putting powder over the top, see if it will stay a bit longer. Um, but yeah, I really, really do like these. Love the packaging. These were £10 each, which I think is a good price, but it's not very good if they're not going to stay on. Um, but I will try with powders and I will get back to you on that because I really, really do love the colours. I think they are absolutely gorgeous. Um, but yeah, I'm on the fence, um, but I really, really do love the colours. Um, there is kind of a fruity smell to them, not an over fruity smell, just like a hint of a fruity smell. Um, but yeah, on the fence. And the next thing is the Lily Cole um, Puff On Radiance, which looks like this and looks so cute on your dressing table. It's got these little pearls in. If I just open it for you, you get the puff, which is a cute little pink bow, which is adorable. Um, and you get like this thing that separates the um, pearls. Um, you get these small little pearls, if you can see them. Now this, when I first got this, because it says puff on radiance, I put the old thing in and put the old puff on my face. In the house, it looked amazing. Went outside, I looked like a disco ball. Um, which wasn't a good look, <laughs> believe me. Um, so then, after that scenario, I tried like putting it in the ends and then trying that way um, to highlight. Um, but that didn't work. The best way, I think that I found is using a brush. I use my contour um, Real Techniques brush and I just dip it in because you've got more of control um, where you want the highlight. Like I put it here, 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 here and a little bit on my head. Um, I've got this highlight on today and I absolutely adore it. Um, I really hope you can see that because it is shines so so lovely. I absolutely adore this but not on a, I wouldn't, um, I wouldn't recommend it for you to like do it like I mentioned before, like that, and put it all over your face. Um, I would not recommend you do that because it is way, way too shiny and glittery. Um, so just a brush and then highlight with it. Um, if I can get a little bit on my finger, I'll try and show you. So there we go, hopefully, hang on, let me just, can you see the shine on the top of my finger there, they're absolutely gorgeous, I love the shine it gives you, it's totally amazing. Um, that was £16, which again is a bit pricey, but then again, I'm only using it as a highlight, so this is going to last me a long, long time. Um, the puff will not go to waste because um, I've even tried this on my arms and on my decolletage, or whatever you call it. Um, it looks absolutely gorgeous, especially when um, you catch the sun and you're in the light. It's amazing. Um, I would highly, highly recommend this. Um, really, really good and I absolutely adore it. Um, what else can I say about this? Um, there's no smell to it. Um, I just love this. Um, really, really, really nice. Um, love the effect it gives. Um, it's really, really nice. Um, so I'd highly recommend the Radiance Puff and also the Shimmer Cubes. Beautiful colours in there. 
I'm on the fence with these but I will still try and find a way to work with them because I reckon they're gorgeous colours and it's a thumbs down for the lip um, glosses. Um, so that, I think that's everything I wanted to say on it. Um, everything I love except the lip glosses. Um, so if go by all means go and check them out. Um, and if you can, do pick these up because they're wonderful. Um, anyway, uh, thank you so much for watching. I hope this helps some of you um, decide what to get and what not to get from the range. Um, if you've got any questions or anything, just comment below and I will get back to you. Um, if you've got any ideas for me to do any other videos, then please do let me know and I'll try and do them for you. Um, so thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Okay, take care. Bye bye.